We were halfway through making Overwatch, and we heard a demo of the Dolby Atmos headphone mix. And I was blown away by the fact that in this scene, when Widowmaker was behind taking sniper shots at the character Tracer, I could easily position her and say she was right over my right hand shoulder, and I could hear the impact in front of me. The light bulb went off and said, well, of course this would be incredible to have in the game. Don't worry, loves. Cavalry's here. <gasps> Atmos brought the missing link, almost the holy grail for us, because how do we convey to players that the threat is behind me? Or there's many times the threat is coming from above. And that's not something that just regular stereo audio could convey. Dolby Atmos creates a lot of opportunity as a competitive player to understand the combat around you, whether it's enemy or friendly. You just have a way better sense of what's happening in the game with Dolby Atmos enabled. Unstoppable! One of the reasons we really were excited about this Dolby Atmos headphone technology is that you can use a regular stereo headset. So something like our Overwatch branded headphones with uh, stereo jacks and one for a microphone and one for your stereo output, and you'll get full Atmos through headphones like these. Locked and loaded. To enable Dolby Atmos in Overwatch, on PC, go to the sound options settings and you will see an option there to turn Dolby Atmos on. And it's really that simple. You just have to make sure that if your headphones come equipped with other 5.1 or 7.1 virtualizers, that you just want to turn that off. You don't want anything else processing the sound except for the Dolby plug-in. Die. Here at Blizzard, we're super excited about the future of Dolby Atmos and what it means for games. And hopefully we'll keep pushing this technology further into the future. Heroes never die. You're absolutely missing out on the full game playing experience if you don't have the Atmos on. We've had our beta going for a little while. Uh, every time I log into the game, I open up my options and turn it on. I kind of wish it was just on by default. We are Overwatch.